Oh, so how does it feel to finally get this project filmed? It was, uh, it was <laughs> I honestly didn't, you know, five, six years, whatever it was, I thought, I, you know, I really kind of thought, okay, this ain't going to happen. You know? It's my dream project. Um, I always thought it was very cool. Um, people seem to always like the script, but they just, you know, didn't, um, they just couldn't find a network essentially bold enough to, 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 to run with it. And the CW, um, Mark Pedowitz, the new president, came in, looked at it and said, he's, you know, he, thank you. He's, he's, um, he was looking for bold material and um, really wants to, uh, you know, uh, uh, direct the course of the CW um, very much to the heart of the audience um, that they've got, which is young, you know, young audience. So, uh, no, the timing for me is perfect. And I didn't, a year ago, if you'd asked me if this was going to be happening, I would say probably not. No. Uh, five years is about kind of, you know, <laughs> the show of life, yeah. What has surprised you the most now that the show's kind of come to fruition, has come to life for you? Um, not so much the surprise as, as much as just how, how really excited I am that it's paying off the way I was dreaming it would, but I didn't know that it necessarily that I would, would pay off you know, as, as well as it is. Um, one of the intents of, of creating the show was, as writers, we're always trying to kind of uh, connect to their audience, and, you know, and in, in some sort of visceral way. And we usually do that through through um, the drama of it, whether it's through um, uh, emotion, sometimes by, through humor. Um, and um, but I, 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 I wanted to get I've written a lot of a lot of stuff over the years, and I really thought it's there, is there a way to connect with an audience on an even more visceral level, and really kind of break down that fourth wall, and really make um, the experience of television show much more immersive. And I looked at there's films like Paranormal Activity, and you go back to Blair Witch, which because they appeared to be found footage, it kind of created that sense of Is this really happened or not. And in the case of shows like or movies like Blair Witch, they really took advantage of online and all that to kind of create that. That, that helped that illusion. Nobody really did that in television, and you can't really do the exact same. They tried that sort of thing in television. But I saw a, a terrific opportunity to, to um, try to blow that line by doing a show um, where the audience at home is watching a show called Cold Cold that's about people watching a very dangerous show called Cold. Um, and, uh, you know, we can kind of blur that. Um, I'm thrilled, and, and the pilot seems to have kind of, you know, to have done that. So, um, it's really the reaction I'm getting from people seem to be that they're getting that kind of where they watch the show and then they kind of look away and it hasn't quite completely left them. You know, it's still kind of lingering with them. And, and so, that, that thrills me. So, hopefully, the show with, on air will be, you know, do the same. Regarding that blurring, is there any chance we'll have a fan domain thing at Comic Con next year? We can only hope. I mean, we, we joke. I, like the fan domain is kind of invented because it's a place I want to go. You know, I wish there was a TV or pop culture oriented coffee place that I could go to hang out and watch TV shows. So uh, we, we joke. We joke on staff that you know we actually the fan domain will become something that Warner Brothers will sell. You know, and they'll start building fan domains, and the TV show will just become a, a, a promotion tool for the, for the real you know, the real money. Revenue source, which is you know, fandom and cafe. And it's, yeah, it's only uh, the whole show, half the show will take place in the fandom and you know, you know, uh, little announce specials and things like that. So. Can you talk about the origin of that phrase? These things just snap right off, and how you came up with that? There's a lot of there's a lot of really I, I, I like the kind of mysterious clue things that are, that are in the show, um, uh, phrases and symbols and things like that. Um, all absolutely within ten. I know the absolute end of the series. Um, there are things in the pilot. It is a mystery, but it's a mystery uh, that has will definitely that has lots of, lots of twists and turns, but will definitely have um, uh, successes and wins along the way. So you're not going to be waiting forever to to know the ultimate answer. Uh, there, there will be an ultimate answer, but um, it's, it, it's potentially not even uh, uh, something that's been introduced yet. So you will have an opportunity to kind of get it to build it. You know. In the perfect world, um, you know, if the network cooperates and the viewers cooperate, how many episodes do you see it? It's a uh, plan that can certainly go uh, like four or five years. It isn't planned out by, by season because I really don't want to you know, describe it that way. I want to be able to, to again, uh, even though I know the plan for certainly at the very end of the, the series and the signpost along the way, I want to be loose enough to adapt. I, you know, I, 
I'm, 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 I'm right. yeah, as you can tell by the, show, the, the nature of the show and my experience with the show is the past particular show I did called Farscape. Um, very interesting, very open and, and anxious for um, fan, fan reaction, fan interaction. I mean, one of the things that fascinates me about the whole social media connection um, that's, that's becoming it's not just fans who are able to connect up with each other, but it's interaction between the sh makers of the show and, and fans as well. Um, which, again, first game was one of the kind of first, just early on in that, in that, in that process. And uh, I just loved it. That was strong. So I want to stay open to kind of being able to, you know, it is, it is, there's definitely a plan. It's not going to change all over the place, but it's, it's uh, yeah, so it's four or five years, I would say. Comfortable, yeah. Thank you.